Hi everyone, meteorologist Taylor Canoost here with your forecast. A very somber Saturday, of course, with all that severe weather that rolled across central and southern Iowa. And just as soon as we get that spring like weather, we're back to the wintry weather overnight tonight. Winter weather advisories will be in effect from 7 p.m. this evening until 7 a.m. on Monday morning for basically the southeast half of Iowa. That does include Des Moines and Ames. And yes, we are expecting snow overnight tonight. Here's the timeline for Des Moines. Our best chances for snow will be in the late evening hours through the early morning hours on on Monday. I think the snow is probably done by sunrise and for the morning commute on Monday morning, but the roads will certainly be slick and we are anticipating at least a couple inches of snow in the metro and across much of our area. So let's show you what that's going to look like here this evening. Maybe a little bit of a mix initially in Ottumwa, but for most of us, it's strictly going to be snow that will begin uh, in the early to mid evening hours, continuing throughout the night, maybe an occasional lull here or there, but there's also going to be some bands of heavier snow mixed in there, so some might get closer to four to five inches while probably most get closer to two to three for the areas that do see the snow. Here is our forecast statewide two to four inches for Des Moines, Creston, Lamoni, Atumwa and Grinnell. Same story farther to the east. You get up to Ames and a trace to two inches is our forecast. Uh, just depends where those bands set up. So it's going to be a close call for you folks in Ames, probably less than an inch, maybe not much at all for you folks in Fort Dodge and those north of the Highway 20 corridor. Here's a zoomed in look for the uh, metro and surrounding communities two to four for Newton down to Pella and not Knoxville, not as much the farther north and west you go, but nonetheless, slick roads are expected, especially for that morning drive. Good news for Monday is it's going to be dry during the daytime and we'll get some sunshine certainly by the afternoon. Temperatures climb back to the mid 30s, so combination of at least a few hours of above above freezing temperatures and the sunshine should improve the roads by tomorrow afternoon and will likely be OK for the evening commute. But again, that morning commute could be dicey. Be careful out there. Forecast highs tomorrow in the 30s. Another cool day heading our way. We will rebound to the 40s, mid and upper 40s on Tuesday. That's probably our warmest day this week. We're back down to the 30s in most spots by Wednesday. Highs could be in the 20s, Thursday, Friday and Saturday to close out this week. And it's not one snow chance. We have two snow chances this week. Another round could be heading our way on Thursday. There is potential for this to be a bigger snow. Now models are kind of all over the place on location, so it's not guaranteed yet that we see snow out of this. But if this model is correct, then we could be looking at a bigger snowstorm heading our way on Thursday. We'll certainly keep a close eye on that as it gets closer. The whole plumbing and heating 10 day forecast showing the cold weather late this week, but we do rebound as we head into next week with 40s by Sunday and back to the 50s by the middle of next week.